You don't have to fear disease and pandemics and isolation because Jesus is with us. trauma with Colette Bowers. How are you today? I want to thank you for joining me as we look into the Word of God for the truth over every trauma that we face. Today we will be reading Mark chapter 16 verse 16. He who believes and is baptized will be saved, but he who does not believe will be condemned. God has given us truth to overcome the things that cause us to be separated from him. Whatever causes us to have a life that brings destruction and ultimately leads to death and total separation from all that is good, which is God. So if you don't know the Lord as your Savior, I want to invite you today to pray with me. And you can repeat after me. Dear God, I'm a sinner. I have sinned against you. I ask you to cleanse me and to make me new, to make me whole, to forgive me of my sins. I believe that Jesus is the Son of God, that he died on the cross for me, and he rose again on the third day so that I eternal. I ask you, Jesus, to be Lord of my life and to make me new through you and in you. And I receive you in my life to be Lord now and forever. In Jesus' name, amen. I want to thank you for praying with me today. And I want you to be encouraged that this scripture now has life for you and for all of us. We have hope. His name is Jesus. We don't have to fear death. You don't have to fear disease and pandemics and isolation because Jesus is with us. I want to thank you for joining me today. If this verse and this prayer that we prayed helped you, I would like to ask you to subscribe, share, like, and hit the bell for notifications. Remember, Jesus is the truth over every trauma that we face. Have a great day. Bye.